Vascular surgery at, at Englewood Hospital encompasses two main, main broad categories. One is venous disease and the other is arterial, which is really the bulk of what we do here. The venous pathologies that we treat are, of course, varicose veins, spider veins, deep venous thrombosis, anywhere in the leg or anywhere in the body. Sometimes that needs to be treated uh, aggressively. On the arterial side of things, we treat all the major entities. The most common is probably peripheral vascular disease, disease of the lower extremities, which can potentially down the road lead to, to gangrene. And the treatments for the low extremities are either stenting, you can do laser therapy, you can do atherectomy, which is like a roto-rooter type of device, and then of course any kind of bypass that would need to be performed in the low extremity, similar to the bypasses that are done in the heart. I really liked the, the complexity of the patients. I liked the, the ability to intervene and see almost an immediate result. If someone has lack of circulation to part of their body, whatever that may be, you fix it and when you're finished with the operation, you see the result right in front of you. The patient notices the result, they can walk immediately. When I was uh, 11 or 12, grew up locally, was in Englewood Hospital for three months with a very bad hip infection. That led to a hip prosthesis when I was like 13. I think that kind of sparked my interest a little bit. It all comes down to excellent patient care. You don't have to have an illness to, to be able to deliver that, but it adds some perspective, I think.